Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. I've got a wonderful feeling. We're off to Shrewsbury. Good morning. Hello. <laughs> Took a day off yesterday. Yeah, a full day off. Why not? Why yeah. not? Uh, heading back into Shrewsbury. We don't know what we're going to do. We never do anymore. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, there is a part we did mention over the bridge we haven't seen. Yeah. We might try just walking along the riverside there, get to that bit rather than go through town. Okay. See how we feel. It's meant to be quite warm today. Um, just see where the day takes us, shall we? Yeah. You see, we've done it. We've practically done it, really, haven't we now? Not really, no. As I say, there's that bit we haven't done. There's actually a... There's a cathedral. There. There's a, an abbey. Oh yeah. We haven't seen any of them no. inside. Okay. <laughs> um, whether we will be or not, I don't know, but still to do. And the museum, remember? Yeah. So this is all new territory for us now. Yes. Not being down this way. Yes. It's like a new town. <laughs> it's a good start. Next to the river. Um, town crier. Mazzy was telling you the other day. The yeah. tallest town crier in Britain. Wasn't he seven foot odd? About seven and a half foot, I think. Um, do you think he is? Do you think this is a real size? I'm five two. No. No? That's not real size. He's only a bit taller than me, I reckon. Let's have a look. He's about foot tall, isn't he? No, he's not, he's not seven and a half foot. <clears throat> oh, it's a beautiful day. Just saying, really is. it's such a lovely walk into town along the river. It's so peaceful. And Apart from the cars. Until you get like near the roads, but yeah. that bit along the river is lovely. Yeah. <sighs> now there were quite a lot of people asking for a Dandini episode. Oh. <laughs> Tried to make you one yesterday, and to be honest with you, um, it was harder than I thought. <laughs> I've learnt a few tricks, which I might throw some into yes. this video. They were good, so good, but you didn't have a vlog there. I didn't yeah. have 30 minutes worth. No. So I might just throw a couple in on each vlog instead. But I had, we had good fun, didn't we? Yeah, Learning yeah. Learning the tricks. Good day yesterday, yeah. So this is the River Thai Bar Restaurant. It doesn't look anything from this side, does it? You can't see it. Um, so they've put this wonderful picture up. Cabin bar now open. Look at that, next to the river on them chairs in the sun. How wonderful is that? You can just see the corner of the balcony here. It would be lovely sat there looking out at the river. But they're not advertising it properly. Should really let people see in, but they've purposefully blocked it off so that you can't see. I suppose it drowns out the sound of the traffic as well. Yeah, but it's better for business when you when you feel like you're walking past somewhere and you want to join in and sit down and that. You want to see other people in there enjoying yeah. themselves. You want to see that it's a used place. And <laughs> if it is, it's obviously nice food. Yeah. If you don't know if there's anyone in there, it might just be horrible. Uh-huh. Practising for the Oxford-Cambridge race, I guess, is waving, look. <laughs> There's a bridge over here. But I don't think that's the bridge we crossed, Mazzy. Can't Looked you remember? This, this yeah, there was the first one we yeah. came across with big stones, but then there was the second one. I think this is the second one we found. This isn't the one we're wanting to cross, isn't it? No. I think it is. No, because we have to pass the other. Do you remember that bony bridgey sculpture thing? Yeah, that's here. No. Yeah, I promise, that's here. I bet it I know, I know my way around this town now. Well, where is it then? Opposite Weatherspoons. <laughs> See, I know you, I know. We haven't been into Weatherspoons here because um, Shrewsbury was flooded a couple of weeks ago and all their cellar got flooded. So they're not serving any drafts at all. So basically, no pints, only bottles. I don't know what going in there for, really, but yeah. So we haven't popped in. Plus, it's a long way from the campsite f to walk. We were all advice to go there wasn't it yeah somebody, but... it looks all right from outside we'll show you well done mazza you were right 
you trust were right. me. Have faith in me sometimes, darling. Check this out. This is amazing. Don't know anything about it yet, but we're going to read up on it and uh, hopefully tell you something. It is the Darwin Memorial Sculpture. Um, <laughs> I don't know what I think of it. <laughs> It looks good, it looks good, but somebody's just walked past and is telling someone else it's cost yeah. half a million pounds to build that. Half a million pounds. That's a lot of wasted money, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, it's like a grown-up's climbing frame, isn't it? I can see some accidents is happening. You know, that. you've got Weatherspoons across the road. Yeah, this is, is the Weather... It's actually Shrewsbury Hotel. Yeah, Shrewsbury mm. Hotel. It looks lovely. So you can imagine them getting drunk there and young lads... Challenging trying to, each other. Yeah, trying to make the way over that. Yeah. So I'm not sure that's a good idea. Especially near the river as well, Ian. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, Charles Darwin Memorial. Is Who's that... Charles Darwin? I think it's that guy who had a load of pet monkeys. Charles Darwin? Yeah. Who's that guy? He's got loads of pictures, hasn't he, of his monkey, like, crouched down, and then it starts standing up and, like, turns into a man. He's got a magic monkey or something, something like that. I don't know. Is it something to do with all this, though? Oh, this, what's this? Really it's going through time, you see. It's all confusing, though, isn't it? Yeah. It's just all your different armoured fish. Armoured fish. That's new to me. Anyway. Moving on. All about Charles Darwin and his pet monkey. What turned into a man or something. Come on, then. Yeah. So we're going over this bridge. That's the theatre. Uh, you know, I like it. I like the look of it. But why do they use wood? Because it clearly needs re-varnishing, re-staining like every yeah. five years. It just looks tatty now, does that bit? Yeah. Um, yeah, it looks quite interesting over there. There might be a few shots for worth us popping in. Yeah, let's go and have a look. It looks like over there there might be something as well. Is that where the cathedral is in that no, one? The no, the cathedral. We've been near it. We might have seen it actually, but not noticed it. Right. It's up in that direction. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh. It's called Welsh Bridge, yeah, this. Yeah, I just noticed that. Can you see what I mean? It's all weathered. It needs sorting out. Come on, Theatre 7. Get it read on. So we'll just come over the bridge. It is nice. There's a big iron bridge over there. I think there's just like one main street going up and down here that might, might be worth looking at. See some old buildings, medieval looking. Yeah, we're looking around and there isn't much on this side. Yeah, there's... although it looks pretty as you enter this street, you get the feeling there's not a lot here. No, there's a pub called the Anchor Inn up there. Yeah. There's a, a Spanish uh, cuisine up there, which looks pretty good. Tapas bar. Tapas bar. Yeah. And behind is a lot, an Indian buffet. No, it was in Indian, but on a Sunday they do a buffet, I was just saying, thirteen ninety five For a buffet? That's no, that's eat as much as you like. You go up, you go, it's not buffet, picky food. It's all right, but no one has Indian on a Sunday. No. For us yeah. potatoes, some beef. Look at this old place, let's look. Books and collectibles, that's a nice building. Check that out. You know, if you're selling old antique books and collectibles. You're welcome to have a look around inside if yeah. you like. This is some of the rooms they just look Oh, can we? Okay. okay, so the owner, or someone who works here, that says we can come in and have a look around. Look at all the old yes. books, Mavic. Oh, it's not just books, look. Oh, look at this little cat. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? It's one of those... Look at what it is. A cat. It's quite nice. Look at all the beams though. I think he was saying it was from like the 1500s. And some oh. of it upstairs is incredible from. Can as I well. look at this book here? Postcards. They're all from Shrewsbury. Oh, very nice. They're lovely, aren't they? Oh, yeah. Oh, I'd love to look through that all night. Yeah, we thought it was just going to be a bookshop, but they do sell other things as well. It's quite interesting, so yeah. we'll have a good look around while we're here. Have a look upstairs. <laughs> this place is lovely. Yes. It's got a lot of rooms. It doesn't look very big from the outside, but it is huge in here. I think we're as high as we can get. I'm not sure. Look at this old drum set. Yeah. <laughs> I can play that, you know. That I mean. 
Oh, the triangle. <laughs> Look at the old grandma for you. That's nice, isn't it? That's lovely. 1922. Check this out. If I could play this, I'd get it. <laughs> Look at that. They've made it out of an old bucket. Four yeah. strings. Four by two. <laughs> that is fantastic. It's good, isn't it? <clears throat> That's class. What is that? A signed picture of Alf Roberts. Alf Roberts from Coronation Street, Mazzy. We've got Vera Duckworth. And Vera Duckworth. <laughs> I prefer Alf Roberts. Very nice. Wonder what that would be from. <laughs> Looks American, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. It'd be cool just like having a conservatory or somewhere, wouldn't it? What was that? Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Comic. Comic room. Yes. You know. Oh, it's a... Well, sorry. I, I've tried collecting <laughs> things in here, like we've both tried to collect, uh, you know, the old tea the and PG cigarette tips. cards. Uh, Brooke Bondi, sorry, cards, whatever cards. they were, yeah. Um, football programmes, football autographs, now we've got comics. It's so many things I've tried to collect over the years and given them all up. So I was never any good at collecting anything. Mazzy would like this. Oh, what is that? What is that? A collection of ancient uh, tins. Oh, yeah, yeah, I love that. <laughs> Very nice. Look at the cornflakes. Yeah. Hasn't changed much, has yeah. it? And the pepper look. Trust me to spot the pepper straight away. <laughs> oh, I love stuff. Oh, look, the wiggly spoon. I remember chewing gum like this. Do you? Wrigglers, yeah. Yeah. So I do. They come in little foils. And yellow. They? Check these out. You know the viewers where you could view your postcards through them? Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful place and the very old cameras here and the oldest tripod I've ever seen in my life. And just finish off with the roof. Very, very, very nice place. You have to come here if you come to Shrewsbury. It's not just a bookshop like that we thought when we were walking past. Yes. It's got everything in here. Right, moving on. Yeah, that was good. Which way out? I have no idea. <laughs> That will just leave it with the door itself. Yes, I just spotted that. An ancient door. Wonderful, wonderful shop. Yes. So if you get to Shrewsbury, get yourself in there. If you can hear it, that is. Oh, I hate noisy people. I hate noisy people. Welsh Bridge, books and collectibles. Get yourself in. It's bigger inside than you think. It is huge, it? and you will yes. get lost, so take yes. a map. <laughs> Another incredible building. Yes. The Seven Tudor House. We don't know what it is. We don't know if anyone lives in there. Check it out. Uh, can you see up there? Might look better from across the road, actually, but very nice. That is well nice, isn't it? Can I just say, if there's anyone watching this and you've got kids who are about 15, 16 and they're thinking about the career, Please, please don't let them become hairdressers or barbers. Why? Because there's a billion of them, Mazzy. Nearly every shop is a barbers. It there doesn't matter. Here, yeah. Everywhere. Every yeah. town, it's just barbers everywhere. Yeah. Turkish ones popping up everywhere. Give them a good trade, you know, like carpenter, c uh, carpenter, plumber, plumber electrician, electrician uh, yeah. anything, anything, but not an hairdresser. We've had enough of them. <laughs> I think we've gone far enough. Have we? Yeah, uh, there's a church up there. I don't know, it's, it doesn't look anything incredible. You've got the old book in there, that looks like a very nice pub. Uh, floristy thing there. That's about it up here, isn't it? Yeah. But it was worth coming just for yeah. the antique place. Just to see the name of this street. It's Which is? Drinkwater. Drinkwater Street. Yeah, that's funny. You know why, don't you? <laughs> I drink lots of water, you don't. He's never had a glass of water since the day we've met. Have you? John Smith's is 95, at least 95% water. Drink water. I drink 
fizzy fizzy orange. That's yeah, about ninety five percent water. I, I drink loads of water. Ignore her. Oh, a cake shop, is it? Oh no, it's a butcher. A butchers. We don't need any food, Mazzy. We've got loads. Oh, I do look good though. Homemade pork pies. Homemade cooked ham. So that was the old building we were just trying to show you. The Seven Tudor House from the other side of the road. Very nice. It is very, very noisy on this side with traffic. Yeah, I'm not enjoying it as much. A lot of traffic. It's worth coming for the antique shop yes. to see the Tudor house. Yeah. Uh, there's a couple of good looking pubs here if you want a drink. Oh yeah, that old one, the Buck's Head or whatever it was. That looked yeah. really old and lovely, yeah. Um, but I will warn you men out there, there, have, there is a bridal shop as well. There's lots of bridal shops. Yeah, that's, <laughs> we're going over the other side at Bridge now. Out at where? Of the traffic, I mean, not of the Should bridal shop. Down shots. there near the river, lad. Oh yeah, well, let's go down here. I love these trees, Mazzy. Yeah. There's the something ones? about. Is I don't know. Are they below? Mm, I don't know what they are. I don't know. Um. I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to think, but I don't know. Uh, it's, yeah, it's beautiful over here. Yeah, it's really nice. It's peaceful now. You're off the road, yeah. away from the traffic. Don't you talk a lot with his hands? What are they? What are they? Oh, we were talking about this hands. the other day, weren't we? Dan does talk a lot with his hands. And another thing about barbers as well. Can, oh, are you still going on? Can people please stop having beards? Every single barber's is... F everyone in there has beards. You know, really cool looking, proper. I like that. Yeah, I can't grow one though, Mazzy. Um, and I'm not going to be the only one sat there who who can't grow a beard, who looks stupid. So just get rid of that fashion, please. Let's go back to dressing like me, looking like me, haircut like me. Well, not like me. You're so bitter today. I'm just a bit off barbers at the moment. I don't know why. <laughs> I've got my wand out. Just come back to his van, haven't we? We've had a lovely day. Yes. But these people have turned up. Loads of people have turned up. Sat down around us. We've got van. a lovely company for the evening. We've got some lovely dogs. Look at the dogs. Check out the dogs. Look at this. If you need any Andrex, <laughs> you need to find these two yeah. on campsites near you. you what lovely dogs. That is the Andrex yeah. dog. <laughs> right, we're going to do a magic trick, Mazzy. Yes. We're going to try. Yeah. So if you can film, yeah. I'm going to use the lovely Lorna. Yes. It's just lucky that a, la a name actually begins with L and goes with lovely. Lovely Lorna, right? <laughs> the world famous Dandini is about to do you a trick. I'm using Lorna. She looks gullible. She looks usable, <laughs> so I'm going to use her. Lorna, I've got a deck of cards there. Right. Proper deck of cards. You can see they're all uh, completely different cards. I'm going to put them down there. Can you split them cards in wherever you would like? That's your choice, yeah? Yep, that's my choice. You're not going to change your mind? Nope. You can do. Nope, nope, that's fine. Okay, are you happy? I'm uh, happy. Right, okay, because she's, honestly, she's terrible at this. Right. You ready? This is where the wand comes in. You ready? Hocus pocus, dickity do. Dandy. I'm ready for my tea and then a poo, but I'm going to have something to... Let's just do this. Right, you picked that card, didn't you? Yes. So that was your card. Yep. Now, I'm going to show you that card. Right. I'm not going to see it. Stand back so they can see I can't see what that card is. Yep. Can we Got show it, it on yeah. the camera? No. Nope. Yeah, oh, in a minute. On the camera. Yep. Can you all see that card? Yes. 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 Can you see that card? Oh, Dad! Hold oh, on. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes. You ain't seen it. I ain't seen it. I ain't seen it. Right. So that's your card, Lorna. You picked that. Yeah. It's on top. You split the pack and you picked that. Yeah. So I've got a magic case. See my magic case? I'm going to open the magic case. I'm going to put it on the table. And I'm going to put Lorna's card in that case. Okay? Okay. You're all happy that is still the card? Yes. yes. Right, I'm going to put that card in there. Yeah. And close it, yeah? 
Yeah. I still don't know what's in that case, do I? No. I have no idea what that card is. Right. I have got an app on my phone. Right? Yeah. <laughs> now, Lorna. Yeah. In fact, all of you, I need you all to stand up here. Stand up? I need everyone to stand up. Go to this side of the table. Yeah. You as well. I am, yeah. Over, over there. there. Okay. You know the card. You yeah. all know the card. Yeah. Let's see if we can find the card. Is that the card? Yes. yes. <laughs> it is. Yeah, it is the card. Bloody it's hell. Fun. You need to film this, Mazzy. Yeah. Christ. Look. Three of clubs. Hang on. It's gone again. And Let's you see. actually picked that, yeah. didn't you? Yeah, we did. Yeah. Definitely. Very good. Yeah. Right. Brilliant. There's more to this trick. There's a lot more to this trick. Now I'm going to take these cards. I've now got your three of clubs in the pack. Right. Have you? No, it's in there. No, it's not in there. It's in here. Right. Do you believe that? <laughs> Do you think there's any way I could have taken that card out of there and put no, it in here? No. 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 Okay. I'm going to make that three clubs appear somewhere else. And you're going to be amazed. Right. Are you ready? Yeah. I'm not touching anything else now. No. Nope. Would you like to lift that down? <gasps> <laughs> no way. The no three way. of clubs. No Brilliant. way! Well, what's so special? What's so special? Oh, is it because it's on the other side of the glass? How did that get on the other side of the glass? Yeah. yeah. You're still convinced your three clubs is in that box, aren't you? Yeah. Come here, Mazzy. There's nothing in that box. Brilliant! <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> now I'll tell you what, I might not be a proper magician and I might be rubbish, but I think I've, I've made them a bit amazed. Yeah, yeah. I, I've just come up with something really cool there. I'm brilliant. I am the amazing Dandini. Are you impressed? I'm very be honest. Impressed. Very Honestly impressed. If, a, if a proper magician showed yeah. you that trick, you'd be impressed, That's wouldn't you? Would. I'd still yeah, be impressed. Stop it, leave it as that. No, I can't leave it as that, Mazzy. I'm, I'm amazing. <laughs> the amazing Dandy. I'm just, I'm just so impressed with myself. <laughs> See you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.